Hi, I'm Average Joe. Uh, so uh, your friend, uh, this uh, this channel. Welcome to this channel. Uh, this channel is mainly for the sharing of the technology of the uh, IT technology, Python, the coding, uh, programming, C sharp, C uh, Python, like something like that. So you are, if you are looking for some knowledge, useful information, so um, you can uh, subscribe the channel to avoid missing future update. So. Okay, so today I will introduce how to uh, remotely uh, access your uh, your uh, Raspberry Pi, Pi 3 or Pi 3B, um, the, the, the equipment to see the temperature of your of your uh, Raspberry Pi. So uh, that uh, it's I think it's uh, useful for you to know uh, the temperature of your Pi uh, to know if it is uh, working healthy or not. So. Um, so, okay, so uh, let's uh, have a look. Okay, let's go. Okay, so now let's move on. Move to the desk desktop of your PC. You can use Win 10 or Windows 10 or the uh, mobile uh, app like uh, Juicy SSH. That's the other thing, uh, mobile phone. On your mobile phone, you can use Juicy SSH or you can use uh, the, uh, I'm using the, uh, uh, Bitwise SSH um, on my Win Windows 10, but uh, you can also use Putty or some other other SSH any tools to uh, remotely access your um, Raspberry Pi 3. So okay, um, I already uh, keying the IP address and the password. Then I click log on, log in. Okay, so this uh, tool will also uh, open the FTP of uh, FTP of this uh, Pi, then it is easy for you to just uh, uh, drag and drop your files from your local uh, PC to the Raspberry Pi's uh, uh, folder. You, you can just drag and drop. But this is not I mainly talk about today, so I will talk about uh, later. Okay, now we already uh, Logging into the Raspberry Pi, then uh, let's uh, uh, write some code to remotely uh, access your uh, Raspberry Pi to know the temperature. Okay, so I will key in some characters uh, to access uh, the code. I will write the code, the Python code, the Python code to remotely access the Temperature, the pi, Raspberry Pi to know the temperature. Okay, so the nano is the default. I mean the default editor of uh, text editor in your Pi. So I will use nano and uh, to use the temperature.py. Let's have a look. Temp.py. Okay. Okay, let's see. I have already uh, coded this, uh, this code. I will give you some explanation. Uh, this is the declaration USR bin, and I also will uh, copy and paste this code uh, down below of this video. Of this video down below, you can uh, copy and paste this code into your uh, Raspberry Pi. So I just uh, just uh, copy and paste this uh, code in my description of this video, just uh, just down below. Okay, I will ex explain the code. First, you need to import the commands and import the time module function function module, then uh, there will be a while true repeat sentence while true uh, here, which means uh, get the temperature. You can uh, get the temperature. This is, is just uh, the explanation after the, the, the hash key. So uh, get the temperature. Then you just declare a variable. Um, you just uh, declare uh, open this file. This file is in the Raspberry Pi system class thermal and a thermal one zone and a temp you just uh, open this file open this sentence to open this uh, this file and uh, the cpu temp rule you just uh, read this uh, read this file you just open temp file uh, to read then uh, temp file just to close this file after you finish the read then you close uh, this file then you needed to do a round to uh, declare a variable 
variable、uh, to round this uh, um, data into、uh, divided by 1,000 to float CPU temp row here, CPU temp row row, and divided by 1,000. Then you will get、uh, the CPU temperature. After that, you will print the CPU temperature, and、uh, here will be time dot sleep one second. So this is a、uh, code. It's right. It's very easy, not very complicated. Okay. So now let's move on to、uh, control exit. Now we let's try to run this code. Python temp dot py then、uh, plus. So now you can see now the, your 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 Raspberry Pi three the temperature the real time temperature of your Pi three,、uh, you can get the temperature to know whether it works healthy or not, or it is、uh, with high temperature. Then you need to consider to install a ele electric fan to cooling the cooling your system or install some uh, um, cooling uh, like a cooling metal, or to cooling your、uh, Raspberry Pi. Okay, so that's easy, right?、Um, so、uh, that's all for、uh, this、uh, sharing of this knowledge. If you like this channel, just、uh, subscribe to avoid future update, to avoid missing future update. So thank you for your watching. Just、uh, good luck, and see you next time. Bye bye, peace.